Channing. Now it's real because it's going to take a minute. There we go. Um, so on, on Rosanna Channing here, I am going to close this. I'm going to go over to manager self-service. And I can see here I have my team calendar. I'm going to click on the team calendar. And uh, let me move my face around here. Uh, and the team calendar, what the team calendar is, is going to show uh, is going to show you and show um, show us first the list of, of your direct reports. So you can see down here on the left, this is the list of all my direct reports. And, and to start off, you know, calendars are hard because everyone's used to using calendars and, and we want to make them as simple as they have on their phones or uh, on their desktop is, is important. So we try to use a lot of the same paradigms. You know, here's a date selector here so I can I can see a bunch of things from uh, people self. So I can see absences, I can see training, I can see performance due dates and milestones, I can see birthdays and work anniversaries, holidays and people's schedules. Um, so this is my team. I can click and go ahead week to week if I want. Uh, if I wanted to use the um, date selector, I could go and use a date selector and pick it, uh, pick a date. Um, so it's simple like that. I can also go and look at a bi-weekly view. So now I can look at two weeks at a time. Um, and show everything there. And um, in when my team, you know, I have a team that has, they have directs. So if I, uh, if I go into John Patterson, you can see I can, I can unfold John Patterson and look at John's directs um, and see those. I also have a way I can look at every, my, my whole team and flatten my whole team and look at that if I want. But in John's directs, he's got a bunch of people, but I'm looking for just the people in the, in the, that are uh, associated with billing. So if I do a search, on billing under John, I can filter it now and see just the uh, the billing specialists on John's team. I can see when they're working, what their schedules are, when they have time off. Um, so uh, let's see. On uh, I can click down Rosanna Channing down here. You can see I'm on John Patterson. If I want to go look at just my directs again, I can do that. I can see Daryl Reese has um, jury duty here. If I click on this. I can go in and now I can um, approve. That's an absence request. It was um, it was not approved yet. So if I want, I can go in and click and, and approve that absence request from here. Um, and and I can also add I can add events. So if uh, John, I don't know why this is I'm spinning. Maybe it's because it was in the past. But um, if there was uh, yeah here, so you can see that should be a lot faster. So I can approve them. I can cancel them. So I can take actions directly from here. Um, which is important. I also can I also can add assets for myself. So if I want to come in here and click on this and add an absence request, I can do it uh, from here. So uh, I can also look at my my peers. So and uh, if I look at my peers in this example, um, I'm going to see different information based on the security that I've set up. So I'm on vacation on on uh, today, I guess, and. Uh, <laughs> Don't feel like it, uh, but um, I can see that one of my peers, Tina, has an absence. So I've set up the system so I can't see what she's doing, what the specific absence is, just that she has an absence. Um, so you know that's that's uh, um, that's important. And so let me show you uh, let me show you a capability here for uh, John Patterson. John has a checkpoint here coming up, um, and I want to use this to go in and look at the the, um, the work we're doing, we've done on the new performance management, fluid performance management. So I'm gonna look at the checkpoint, I'm gonna open the document and go into uh, the, the checkpoint, uh, the performance checkpoint. Here's the fluid performance document um, that we're working on. I'm not gonna spend a lot of time on this, but I can add, I can add uh, comments, I can add dates, I can add, um, uh, share it with, uh, get other approvers and commenters. I can change right now. I have this set so John can see all the updates. So I've already delivered this to him. But you get a sense uh, for team calendar how I, you know, from from the team calendar, I have a single, basically dashboard now that I can get into all the different transactions, and it really serves as a way of integrating multiple people soft functions together. Um, so that is the uh, that is the team calendar.